What's cracking, what's cracking, mother truckers? Figured we'd do a video game segment today. Figured we'd go ahead and start it. Today we're doing Forza Motorsports 4. Because now I got the Xbox cords in finally. I had to order the damn, uh, Still fucking with a strap on it. It's a little weird. I had to order the AV cable. Or no, I had to order the power cord. Because it was cheaper. And I bought the AV cables from the store for the Xbox. Because it was... $10 at the store, the power box was 40 so I ordered the power box and got it cheaper than that, so. Dip of the day. Dipping on some Copenhagen wintergreen, y'all. Told y'all we'd be starting these video game segments. But uh, we're playing Forza Motorsports 4. So, I ain't played this game in a very long time, so. Still adjusting on the tripod some. Probably as good as I'm gonna get it right there. All right, Joe. Apparently, before my Xbox tore up, I had started fixing a bunch of cars. Hadn't done it. But, uh, I had started fixing a bunch of cars and forgot about it, so. We're going to go through my car list first. Show y'all what all I've got. I've got eight. $815,000 in the bank, but the last one I got was a 1964 Impala Super Sport with a 409. I've got a 2011 Nissan Micra because I need it for certain races because I've gotten so far on this game now that I can't progress in the career anymore until I go do the special races and level up. So... Stuck doing that. And I need a bunch of different cars to do, go through all that shit. Until I can level up enough. Got a 2008 Alfa Romeo Mata or whatever. 70 Chevelle Super Sport with a 454. Be in mind, a lot of these cars have been highly, highly upgraded with racing parts and engine swaps and shit, but I just don't remember which ones. Got yeah, damn 2010 Volkswagen Golf GTI. Got the 1994 Toyota Celica GT. 300 SL Gullwing Mercedes Coupe from 50, 1954. Damn, TV's bright. Got a 1970. Corvette ZR1, I think it's got an engine swap in it, I'm just not sure. Got a 91 GMC Cyclone. 1968 Shelby GT500 KR. 1960 Corvette, it's got an engine swap in it, I know that for a fact. That's, I've had this car on here a long time. 2008 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution X GSR. 2010 Shelby GT500, 1970 Z28, 69 Dodge Charger, 2003 BMW M5, 2011 Mercedes Benz SLS AMG, 2010 GTR Skyline, 2010 Ferrari 458 Italia. 92 Honda NSX, 
95 Ferrari F50, 2010 Corvette, 2011 Ford Performance Racing Falcon, Chevy Monte Carlo stock car, Skyline race car, and a 2009 Acura Tribute. But, the car, when I first turned the game on, before I started this video, was this damn Impala. And it has an engine swap in it that I forgot all about. And I took the liberty of going ahead and put my damn K&N racing stickers on it right there. On both sides. Go into the upgrade shop. It's got a... It ain't got stock engine in it no more. It's got a V8 Corvette C6 ZR1 V8 in it from Corvette. Still got the stock aspiration. Took the liberty of putting some damn street tire or some um, new wheels on it and some sport tires. And this is the wheels we've got on it. Decided to make the car white. It was the stock, like a light blue color, but other than that, stock air filter, stock fuel system, stock ignition, stock exhaust, stock cam, stock valve, stock displacement. It has a sport twin turbos. Got racing brakes, stock springs, racing clutch, racing transmission, race drive shaft, and racing differential. I'll show y'all the test drive because this car is bad ass. We're gonna go to my hometown track, Road Atlanta. Show y'all what this Corvette engine would do in a damn Impala. Pretty badass. This is at racing speeds. Hmm, <coughs> head spit, yeah. Badass car right here, though. By the way, I am getting some more games tomorrow, and I'll be doing them in the video game segments too. I don't know if I'll do the videos tomorrow or not. I might when I first start them. 120 mile an hour at this track. And this is cruising speeds. It handles really well at cruising speeds. Sixty mile an hour. Then when you 
stand on it, it damn it has great acceleration. Good brakes too. Turn too good though sometimes. Anyway, that's the Impala. I'll do anything else to it, I'll update you on it. Might try to do tune it. Put a tune set up in it. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to do some research on the tune setups for the different cars on here. Because I really don't want to fuck it up. But anyway, that's the tuning screen. I done took the liberty and tinted the windows a little bit. I'm so tired of seeing white and pop or I'm so tired of seeing black and pause. But I don't want white because it don't show it's too much of damn glare. But it had a killer like this in it. Already on its stock the killer was like it. I think I'm going to go with that color. Anyway, I hope y'all like the damn new video game segments or with the car games. I show y'all the cars and shit. Fix them up and shit. Show y'all how I do things. We'll catch y'all on the dip side. If I do any more, I'll get some more videos. Of the updates, or do anything else to it.